From the collections of Tehillim Psalms, Psalm 102, a prayer of the afflicted, when he is overwhelmed and poureth out his complaint before Yahweh. Hear my prayer, O Yahweh, and let my cry come to thee. Hide not thy face from me in the day of my distress. Incline thy ear to me in the day when I call. Answer me speedily, for my days consume away like smoke, and my bones are burned as a firebrand. My heart is smitten like grass and withered. For I forget to eat my bread. By reason of the voice of my groaning, my bones cleave to my flesh. I am like a pelican of the wilderness. I am become as an owl of the waste places. I watch and am become like a sparrow that is alone upon the housetop. My enemies reproach me all the day. They that are mad against me do curse by me. For I have eaten ashes like bread and mingled my drink with weeping because of thy indignation and thy wrath. For thou hast taken me up and cast me away. My days are like a shadow that declineth, and I am withered like grass. But thou, O Yahweh, wilt abide forever, and thy memorial name to all generations. Thou wilt arise and have mercy upon Theon, for it is time to have pity upon her, For an appointment is come, for thy servants take pleasure in her stones, and have pity upon her dust. So the nations shall fear the name of Yahweh, and all the kings of the earth thy glory, for Yahweh hath built up Eon, he hath appeared in his glory. He hath regarded the prayer of the destitute, and hath not despised their prayer. This shall be written for the generation to come, and the people which shall be created shall praise Yah. For he hath looked down from the height of his sanctuary, from skies did Yahweh behold the earth to hear the sighing of the prisoner, to loose those that are appointed to death, that men may declare the name of Yahweh in Theon, and his praise in Yerushalem, when the peoples are gathered together, and the kingdoms to serve Yahweh, He weakened my strength in the way. He shortened my days. I said, O my God, take me not away in the midst of my days. Thy years are throughout all generations. Of old didst thou lay the foundation of the earth, and the skies are the work of thy hands. They shall perish, but thou shalt endure. Yea, all of them shall become old like a garment. As a vesture shalt thou change them, and they shall be changed. But thou art the same, and thy years shall have no end. The children of thy servants shall continue, and their seed shall be established before thee.